Okay. Good evening, good night, good morning, good afternoon to some of you that may be listening to us from wherever you may be on the face of this planet Earth. We welcome you all to our today's live broadcast today right here from our homeland radio biafra here in biafra land where i am broadcasting from thank you so much again i remain the fearless ipb evangelist i am from Ndiabo. There was an Anemri, and then it's a local government in Ojiba province, Biafra land. I am a homeland broadcaster under IPOB. Nam the Khan is our leader, Adia Makwama, in case you don't know. <laughs> Maybe they try to convince you. But you know, we have seen Ogudere, and we have seen those that Obasanjo campaign for. Uh, somebody that is, uh, the, uh, the other one, the one that is coming to the place in Nam Khan, he is more deadly than Nam Khan. He is a Finnish lawyer. He is a Finnish army. <laughs> Abbasanjo was campaigning for their, uh, um, <laughs> for their idiots. <laughs> so that news um, houses, media houses will get the signal that uh, the agreement has been signed. The sabotage agreement has been signed with one criminal in Finland. We move. Let us pray then and mark these people out. Narekele na roti to na roti jaman na mbulelo na richi sibu china di rebi ebi adaya ana atu fregi aka all di wa marriage all ya mbali piobi tishiki kena mbika no kura ina ogi jindu ya all ya kura ina ogi wa poria all kura ina ogi wa mire do he will write piobi all ya mbali jindu tishiki kena ele kula ni otai ne si abago kudi chi otai si te umugi ai bo umugi ai no wani ne. Oto se dia ino bika ino se abagi. Ufado na ano ni mo na. Ufado na ano ebe di chiche. Kama hii ga rota wuna. O agi waka ibu nopi. Ba arani. Oto abula isi. Ubagi oku. Chukwa abi amu. Kama ne magu. No mwen yi honso ha korani. Na abon nam de kano. Obi amere. Mbo fada ni ewe iwe. Mbo fada di kone. Yobi a idi ufado ni ma ikone. Dezeke. Ile yene menani. Mwabu ye nandin nana ye duga ya na imu ni hendi kagi. Chi. No di yo nyonso. Ayino mwaye witness ya ya nebo chi. Ihi me godrumbe wani ino emre e landa si blokedi. Odi anye to nanya. Na ye kadendo ta. Ayin chukwara wani ino. Ele anya na ye gade. Kama ni ino zi anya. Mbo lilanya ye kuro. Ki ino anyo lilanya. Inya ye namde kano. Sinaki ya ye mwaye piyobi. Ewe ru zi mbe. Obi ya ini ino. Na achi kotalono. Mara ni eza wanye be. Habi ya nana ye namde kano. Giwa no magi buchi, ima na yebo madu. Ode mba yi gezu oki. Ayi da pronounce ode ichi ichi. Ma yi jide kura anye, bako kwa anye onu. Yaka yi jina anye oki. Uzo osi yi geji ata na jire anu. Shio ta anu ta anye anu. E jizina condition of continuous illegal detention of namdekanu. Na ata na jire anu. Wero uzo oso, hapura anye namdekanu. Na anye yaka anye 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 Aina ekele kwa ki, oti si ma ya ba yo kri kri. Obo na ye ha pori ya, nka ya agago. Nare ekele, ezu uto. Nara oji jamma, oti se boka ya no wani ini. Nara kwa mbuli elu, oti ka sile eche hando. Namba yi kino fondo juna nga, he wugo kuu fondo. No budo di chi iche. No wa. O kwendi nke ese evu, maka kwa shoko. Ayama ze, haa buru chagondi obo da eba. Ma ye mara no ki ibazo. Ni gemecha ki hendi ya bena na mezu. Ka hama ta na hawa ndi ya ba. Oga ya mezu kwa na uwe mbe. Na uwe mbe biafra bena. Ya ka ina yogi nyaye biafra. Nyaye na mde kano kwa pota na kandiru. Na reke le na rotu cho. Ne cheko kwa ndi ya ino wanine. Na jira na papa nkata. Ne de ne de gide. Ne bo he bubo. O kwa ndi ya baro sondu ya ba. Aka na achukwa ha. Aina yogi. Mezira nyo siso. Mera nyo siso. Na uwe ya gesefu ndi ya no kudo ibo. Oku ya gese vunde no na biafrala. Oku ya gese vunde no nugu ausa. Oku ya gese vunde no na ala yoruba. Na ni mwere umwe. Na rekele na rotutu. Ni hinebochi.
na hagi chi ogwu ogige abia amara pọrọ ime ihe nile we have prayed he said he said he said thank you thank you thank you mo chineke the the very facebook you know they have shut down one of our big page they unpublished omote biafra page am omote biafra tv facebook ha akukwa anya oso facebook akukwa anya ihe gazia follow your omote biafra now na uhobo u r h o b o idese biafra tv omote biafra then we move we will start by calling the name of the supreme court judges the program will not be long the touch of magwam na inga na abaru no touch i inga na aba touch to the right direction ke mari ba na aga dare to dego sigina o mo ma na na inu ya o ma na inu ya o ma na inu ya obi karia oto ogwara na ebe ejishike o si na na ajo madu biko right so i can't even abara the touch ke na ho te bo bo de mmecha nge wote kwa video nge me video maka ndia this supreme court judges i will make a video with their pictures we will still come again with the informations both to their children both to their wife both to them both to their relatives we will get all let us start first by calling their name for the world to know those that fees death of court and trying to because so it's just a rumor trying to truncate the death of court i want the world to know the people not uh, market leaders or traders no these are supreme court judges of nigeria of nigeria this is since october 2022 They have never allowed to hear the case of Nam. The appeal is supreme against his illegal detention. The world should get their names because we are going to naked them. If there are those other ones left behind, we will still get their names. This is I ask them can I not have a touch? I will go and do so. Can I have a touch? I now hold Kemare Boko Anaga. akokwa akukefu adizile emeye ndi emeni hobula aga di west just last time we need mba mwe lozi ge be different na mikanu the supreme court the the hashtag ogula gawara onwe gi irugo kwaru for the day ogwa akwa imeri anye mu vote ndi oso the next ndiru emeri da haya na aga okuta isa aga ai ge ruri na last bus stop but the supreme court has na last let us call their name the names of the supreme court judges that face death of court um the hearing of namdikan um uh, appeal in supreme court the last sitting was in may 2023 and the first adjournment to september 2023 five months adjournment but we can minimize it to four let us help you supreme court let us make it for you know you went to school i have all of you are you are justices isn't it uh, but we want to bring out your injustice you know you are justices uh, but there are injustices here that's what we are bringing from october 2022 that then the kanu was discharged by the appeal court of nigeria 13th of october 2022 that the 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 Nigeria went and they filed stay of execution and they executed it illegally. We as IPOB always remain law abiding. Now we maintained it was our opportunity to go violence. They disobeyed a hard earned victim in the appeal. We followed them keenly we go to supreme. Are we wrong by going to supreme? No, we can never be wrong. Rather, Nigeria will be wrong, and their Supreme Court judges will be wrong. 
We are always right. We are IPOP. Let me call their names. Then we analyze. Oh, what they are going to do? Back or going to? Back or going to? As in within one week, they must get big. If they are not well, they must. If back, they okay. Very much. Game round or one hand. Within one week, two weeks, or going to Morocco. I go to Nigeria. Come in. Okay, I don't get to Morocco. I ain't scared not to pay twice. I go do ten ten minutes or twenty minutes of. 50 minutes or one hour program. Kena whatever in Aga. Thank you. Omo Chineke. Well, uh -huh. Chief Justice. Oluka Yode. Ari Wola. Chief Justice of Nigeria. Supreme Court judges. Musa. Dati Joe Muhammad. Supreme Court judge. Kudirat. Kekere Ekun, a woman, Supreme Court judge. Chima Sentus Mweze. Mweze. Chima Sentus Mweze. Supreme Court judge. Chima Sentus Mweze. One year. Our suit has been in the Supreme Court. Chima Sentus Mweze. Supreme Court judge. I know. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, my brother, that sent this uh, information as we demand for it. More are still coming. We will deal with them. Take a batch of torture for which we can. Can we go off? What I say, I can have my POB. If one of my IPOB people has a, they will stop. So let us continue. Amina Ogi. The Ogi is A U G I E, Ogi, or what? I know why I spell it. A U G I E. Amena Ogi. Uwane. Nsobodi kwa u. Ano kwa mo uwane. Uwane. Gezien aha. Supreme Court judges. Uwane. Uwane. What is, what is that in my head? Uwani Musa Aba Aji. Uwani Musa Aba Aji. Supreme Court judge. Come to the moon. I'm going with the pictures. Huh? Pictures. Huh? After section of video with pictures, the next one with the no more information about their family, about their wife, about where they marry from, their siblings, their relatives. Okay, back. Each we go near, and you will have your nose. John Ingan Okoro Okoro Azopa Okoro Azopa Okoro Pa. I can never miss it. Okoro Abata Pe Game. So Okoro, I want to say that Okoro is by Okoro. Okoro, Chief Judge Okoro. So I want to say that Okoro is one year. From October to October, I hear that target is a lie. It will end in September 14. I got one or Tony Moore. So, oh no, don't worry, time is coming. None of you will travel. I get a moon, I suppose. I take a bottle of hack and that you'll be whatever. I am a man. I am a good boy. John Ian Ian. I N Y A N G Inya, like a pipe bomb. You know we have people there. So John Inya, Okoro, we have them in Kalaba also. We have them. You can get such name there. In a pipe bomb, right? You will get them in um, Cross River. Then you can even see get them around on the Changwa. You can still get them such name around um, Akwete, right? Azumiri. You can still get such name. <laughs> it, it always meets. They are closer. So one of these places, that's where you come from. You came from. John A. and we coach Supreme Court judge. So Iso, you are one of them. <laughs> okay. Okay. So bad. Okay. Okay. La wa al garba. 
Supreme Court judge. Helen Emu Ogu Miju Ogu Mu Miju Helen Emu Ogu Mu Miju O G U M W U M I J U Supreme Court judge. Adamu Jauro Adamu Jauro Justice Adamu Jauro Tijani Abubaka Justice Tijani Abubaka We are still putting them justice Time is coming when we remove justice If they try You know they will try to do like it We will remove justice We will put in justice <laughs> Then they will get it hot you may be saying, what, what will it do to them? Mbo Setri. Iga man, I remember the foolish be popular. Tijani Abubaka. Another one. E man, I don't know. E agim. In Azaba, handen ba no. In Azaba, handen o kibwe sinetaria zon. In Imo State. Agim. 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 So, e ba konu shita. Excuse me. Oh, Agi Mukwa, na Supreme Court judge, judges, one year, uneti bohono na hiyari, ewa Agi Mu, Agi Mu, from a key west material zone, onwe ban hash, e budia hanish. Kobo le bora, e me ban handi hanish. Then let me call them online. Ko edre me na description of this very program. But I want to call them online. You know, I was uh, talking while calling their name. So I want to call them online. Chief Justice of Nigeria, Justice Oluka Yode Ariwola, Ariwola Musa Datijo Muhammad, Justice so, Supreme Court Judge. Justice Kudirat Kekere Ekun, Supreme Court Judge. Justice Chima Sentus Mwezi, Supreme Court Judge. Justice Amina Ogi, the Supreme Court Judge. Justice Owani Musa Aba Aji, Supreme Court Judge. John, Justice John Enyan Okoro, Supreme Court Judge. Justice Lawa Alokaroba, Supreme Court Judge. Helene, Justice Helene Emu Ogumumiju, Supreme Court Judges, Judge. Justice I Eno Emu Solawa, Supreme Court Judge. Justice Adamu Jauru, Supreme Court Judge. Justice Tijani Abubakar, Supreme Court Judge. Justice Emmanuel A. Agim, Supreme Court Judge of Nigeria. Chineke, mere mere mere. He, he, hola, udiwa wa asegel wo. Ay, mere gong kozo. Kozo ilo, the highest one. Kai, kai le sa ata yandia Nigeria. Kai le sa ata yandia. Do you use, eh, hola, check an... I don't know. Let me use English after all. A why am I going on a radio before before me after all? You see these judges. This is like you be media warriors and the Biafrans and the lovers of freedom. Any hand in the India, any hand you give to them now will determine their next step. Ruin their heart. Make a hundred billion dollars. Come back on them again. The lawyers of Barigama. Okay, my hand on the same line with the judges. How they defend the he is the constitution, right? And then I'm becoming the main the constitutional. Now, how by like the expo, as then I'm becoming the do. Then how it will go appeal. Came a PK new date. Then our duty will I'm an I am an I with it of court. Make another date on your post. Yeah, we'll do 14th of September. Up a date of court time. Oh, we'll say after reaching that day, my court is sitting. I am here with another one. But for now, how do you any lawyer and the boy have to see more? Here they got information directly to the and they have discharged our leader. You must insist. Now, I will date. And then I will date of court. 14th of September. 
Eshake you balance shift to clear, right? Pin here at there. Pin here at there. Why we campaign for Sabotua Day? Right? That Sabotua match is together. So after the Mahafe law, and you will say the two things in record because now they are supposed to act, the judges are supposed to act like human beings, not, not like fools. They have to pay back with 14th of September 2023. To, to at least to calm us down over the crimes of Nigerian government through their Nigerian army by declaring pattern that killing our people in their attempt to kill Namdekano, which resulted to the death of 28 Igbo men instantly in the palace and their dark. Then they went ahead, blocked the road, start killing us. We discovered 15, um, seven graveyards in the bushes in Biafra land after the Python dance. There are those they threw inside the river. We didn't see them. Then we come up with this. We said, why can't you replace that crime? At least pet us with starting, um, 14th of September 2023. Or do you think that our God wasn't in the court when you picked the date? Supreme Court judges. Ari Wola, Chief Justice of Nigeria. You are their head. So you don't even know that the date of court you picked, date of hearing of Supreme you picked, was spiritual. So you are not you are now telling us that you wasn't aware or you aren't aware that Nigeria Army attempted to kill Namdekan 14th of September 2017. So you don't know when you feast 14th of September 2023. That it should be a day, a day to pay us back at least with this, a little smile, because not big smile, a little smile. We will rejoice at home. But to the Nigerian judiciary, it is just a little because they are still owing us justices. The discharge of Namikano unconditionally by Justice Tadebola, Nigeria is owing us this debt. They have not obeyed. 2015, December 20th. The discharge, discharge of Namikano unconditionally by Justice Johnson, Nigeria is still owing us this debt. The, just, the, just, the judgment has been passed. They are still owing us. We are not worried for now. They will pay us when time come. The bail they granted the Namdekan, they did not allow him to enjoy it. They are still owing us that one because we we met up with the bail conditions. Do you understand? And they committed murder and sacrilege and abomination for shedding blood in the palace of His Royal Highness, Lady Israel Okukan, in a palace in Ibo land, shedding of blood by Nigerian army. It's a sacrilege. It's an abomination. It's unacceptable. Now, why is it that Ari Wola and his panel of Supreme Court judges cannot settle this matter with 14th of September 2023 to pay us back on over the invasion of the home of the leader of indigenous people of Biafra, Mazenam Khan, and killing of people? Facebook, are you crying? No, don't cry now. Don't cry. <laughs> we are freedom fighters now. Do we have gun? Why are you tackling the program? Do I have gun? Only microphone. But you put microphone in, pro in Facebook. Do you not put microphone? Uh, is it IPOB that uh, put microphone? Is it IPOB that approves live brokers? Is it IPOB that approves live brokers? Why are you disturbing yourself? Excuse me, let me pray. Hell, let us move. Okay, it's all right. Now, we have called the names of the Supreme Court judges that we got a signal from the lead council to Namdekan, that they are they will resume their court announce they will resume court 25th and the lead council is appealing that the the Supreme Court should fix 28. Do you understand? Uh -huh. But we as their friends and IPOB we know we have date of court 14th of September 2023. 
The lawyers are doing their work. But for us, we have date of court. 14th of September. 20th. Okay, now what I have to do. We have to do a shift to call. A shift to call. Happen the lawyer can roll. A shift to call on a date. And a apple call. Apple call on a date. After the date, my head will do court. Apple call on a date. After the date, my head will do court. Apple call on a date. Okay, now we press the list IPOB. How will I get a date of court for 10th? And I get free count for 10th. Okay, what are the points? Everyone can have to work. Right? So, if you get a hook, 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 next date of court, you get a hook, 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 Direct, yeah, it happens regular. It's our duty. How can such panel of Supreme Court judges, we know the judges, learned men, you know, but ask yourself, why is it that? Even in primary school, they used to call them headmaster. Why is it that when they close schools, like they close schools like July to resume September, why is it that they don't fix examination date in August when they know they will resume in September? Have you ever seen a school that fixed resuming of a uh, res, um, resuming date on the 25th and the fixed exam on the 14th. But uh, the, these Supreme Court judges see what they acted as if they don't have bearing, as if they are not judges. Something social club cannot do, so something union cannot do, something. Churches cannot do something a family cannot do. No family can face a burial without checking it. No family can face a burial date without checking it. Even they will know when it's in court. They will know when it's after. They will know the day it is, whether it's a cake or a unko or holy or after. They must know. Whether it is on Sunday, whether the AK is on Sunday or is um, on Saturday. They will try to shift it and fix it normal. But Supreme Court judges fix date of court, looking at us down, and people are don't worry, that's why we told our people we have date of court 14th of September. Because it was a rumor. Do you understand the point? As them can now go neighbor Guanaga. He manipulates new point of argument. A bit I can add on my daughter. So I have a kind of whip to attack and does only whip with them. If I don't dare and post. Post where you could have done God the post. That is a lot of rush here. God the post within the minute. Our people they go through post and they go to book. But right, so I talk a post to change it. I talk a video to change it. I talk argument to change it. All our point are not going to change it. Mundos are going to be across or an agavanaga. A prayer. And then, kind of now with the men. Then let us continue. I ask a question, and I am asking the Supreme Court judges now, direct. Let me start from the Supreme, um, uh, what is it called? Chief Justice of Nigeria. Uluka Yobre Ariwala, Chief Justice of Nigeria. Have you ever seen a school that closes school in July? To resume school in on, on September 21, and they now fix examination in the school on the 11th of September. Have you ever seen it? I've not even come for secondary school. I am still in primary school. I said, have you ever seen a headmaster that did it, or headmistress that did such thing? Now I ask you, 
Have you ever, even social club, they calculate everything because before the feast and events. Are, are you telling us that they want to joke with us? Or are they not Supreme Court judges? No, I want to, I wonder if businessmen can fix their date normal in their business activities. If people that didn't want to went to school can calculate well and manage their days. Why is it that Supreme Court judges, which the chief judge of Nigeria is included, why is it that they cannot manage date? Why is it that they want to try us? Why is it that they are trying to test us? Are they not aware of where we came from? From Federal High Court to Appeal Court, from Appeal Court to their Supreme have they forgotten time of trial? So they think that what we saw during the trial can be compared with their own. Their own is just a simple matter. The case of Supreme Court is a simple matter. Because you cannot jail an American in Supreme. You, can jail, you cannot jail him. And trial have ended. On an American. So we have crossed the time of trouble when we, you may be expecting, hey, they may jail him, they may sentence him to death, they may win and uh, uh, send him to life imprisonment. That one is gone. Ari Wala, Chief Justice of Nigeria. You are head of Supreme Court, isn't it? Then let us call another one. Musada Dijo Muhammad. So are you telling us that you don't know that 14th of September is the date of? Court of Unamdekan, or do you think it came by mistake? No, it was a coincidence. It is a coincidence because it was the particular day your army went to kill Unamdekan, 14th of September 2017. So, 14th of September 2023 is a very wonderful date. If you try to truncate it, you, you will know the meaning of that date. You know, one thing we know is that. In IPOB, we always remind them. We always tell them the truth. Our God speaks through us. I am just giving the message. It is not by mistake that you fix the date of God, 14th of September. Reason back to 14th of September, by dance, 2017. Then brought forward to now. Compared to 14th of October, September 2023, should be a day of freedom of Unamdekan. Don't truncate it. You, you, it wasn't by mistake. The, that, this date wasn't by mistake. It wasn't. Nobody should joke with us. I met somebody in Ekun, Chief Justice of um, Supreme Court Judge of Nigeria. Man, you now woman. All of you thought you are you joke with us. See them now. I will just see them. I will just uh, very soon. I will bring their 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 this thing. Let me come up with. Uh, see them now. See them now. These are them now. Uh, and, I, and, I, and I look at them. We know them. These are them. These are the Supreme Court judges. Let me get more of their pictures. You know? See them. See them. You know? Uh -huh. So we are coming up with a video. They should do something because we, we have a way of fighting legally. You know? <laughs> <laughs> we always love Biden. <laughs> we are POD. So you think we are not working? We are certain. Right? We know the duty in our hand. They must hold our they must sit our court. They must sit our court. Supreme Court judges, they must sit our court. Come back on the two weeks are a very serious war. Our two weeks. A equal order. He shall be over two weeks at the way they call in India. A criminal wine and I have lawyers. 
Akwe ma no go ahead na help lawyers. Yes, I will deal with the video online. With the video, I'll be calling their name. Their picture will be coming. I'll be analyzing. In game, many video. I'll go with video now. Thank you. I met Andy and Yende will know. I met you with them come on. Thank you, Munya. Each and every week, you look at our date of court. So you think you, you don't look when you start, you resume, uh, your vacation will end. You fix date of court, and then I can in you. All these women who need to need to take the root daughter, you want to change their color. Let on only go to only Allah one side. Let let them fix date of court. Let 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 only go. Only I got to know only show. I got to know only show. All one one can I might be a bit of surprise. Lanya, George, you go ahead by him. Let go, let go down, let go, let go. Let me see the people that fix date of court. Fourteenth, and they turn around try to tell us story. See their face, layer, 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 layer. I na get a bar ekwa. I na get a bar ekwa. With the kugu, mm mm, kugu au sanka. With the kugu au sanka, nka. I'm in the chamber, no need to be chuna. Do you understand? They must sit our court. Judicial and Kaike. They must sit our court. Of all the one hour, Omechagodu and on at the tent, now we're going to ask you to continue your campaign. Continue. Do we say I only think a GA may achieve? Continue. Even one hour to 14th, I'm going to court at the continue. Okay, the IPOB press release also. Oga help IPOB press release the following one. After her, her truncated the date. Then okay, this lawyer Sanyaka. In a drag, right? A bam, and we can her date. Then here we go no be no be nine the bar in Quadobe. Because I have a great I went up to one and when in your zin I give me now. Apart from the Sun Bia for can you see what else are you going to do? Oh, when you also in a game, I don't think I'm more or some other way also. So, when you have the option, thank you. I just think it. I'm fine. I don't know. No, no, no. So, what we are telling Nigerian government is that the debts they are owing us have not even been paid. The debt of justice, they have the state in African slavery. None have been obeyed, though. You know, when we are talking about uh, a big court ruling, they will think as if they have obeyed anyone. Since 2015 till today, tell me the ruling of the court on Nam Dekano, on the favor of Nam Dekano, or on Nam Dekano's case. Because every ruling favors him and favors IPOB. Tell us any a single one they have obeyed. Is it bell? Common bell. Common bell. You are still you were still with his passport. Still, you went to kill him. You seize everything, you granted him bell. You see when how do you expect him to go away? You know he was not going anywhere. And you came to kill him. You are still owing us because we met up with the bad condition. Aya kaya kula nde madam. Happening here kaya na ngoko yon. Nde aji kuna anyo ngo. Ote si den ki umu izre la. Asi na agwa haga agwa ambaji. Onyo bila hasi nye ha gode. Nye ha gode. Nka yon ngo ya ena se ya nye ha gode. Mo ya nye ha ye ereng. Haji anyo ngo. Haga kwa nye ha. Aige jibi dondo. Seke yon wago do justice is in that. De tuwe ya. Hage meri mwa anye. People turn on a court hand with a no hand and the other than he. Get a hand and make it as a country. You need to hang. And then you have fine. And then you can have a good use. 
Oh, yeah, I see you. Oh, 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 man. I'm back here. Hap, what victory? I'm back here. Pack away, and you have to go. I'm going to go to the court. I'm going to go to the court. Oh, 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 oh. Thank you. I do, man, man. How can Supreme Court panel of judges gather on a very serious case like the case of Nam they can they will pick a date of court and after four months they will not tell us that they are they will resume a vacation and like, what is our business businessmen knows everything they they have they even know calendar people that didn't go to school they have diaries. They put things down. Some carry it on their head, in, in their head. Even this small, small social club they perform, they can't fix a date against themselves. They calculate very well. How can you fix date of court against yourself? Something primary school cannot do. They can never fix an exam before the day they will resume school. They cannot. So nobody should joke with us. Nobody should play with us. Because we are not going to take it easy with anybody. What do they want our lawyers to do? Lawyers that have been securing victory from court to court, from court to court, from court to court, victory from victory. Do they want the lawyers to, keep, to come with, to court with a gun? They always come with your constitution. They defeat you. And that's what you presented to the world. That man can defend himself in court. Do they want our lawyers to come with the gun? No. Every weapon needed in the court to, to defend Namdekan against your allegation have been presented. And you cannot present your defense and he have been winning you. You have no defense. So what do you expect? Because that thing you expect will come from IPOB. Our lawyers cannot do. We don't have gun. But for now, you know we have the right to defend ourselves, after all. So, these are the uh, Supreme Court judges. We are asking them, if any of their child, or if their wife, or grandson, or child, grandchild, fall sick on the 14th of September, will you take them to the hospital? If you yourself fall sick on the 14th of September, will you go to the hospital? Will you take any medication? If yes, because I know you, you will, then know you that Namdekano's life and freedom is greater than all of you, both your family and Nigeria entirely. Do you know why? That thing you say it is your constitution that made you a country, you have destroyed it. Namdekano is more valid than your constitution and Nigeria. Until you obey court order. Even these people that call themselves judges, to me, they are no longer honorable men. Anybody that says a senator in Nigeria is no longer a senator, is not an excellency, nothing. Do you know why? They made law in Senate, they made law in House of Rep, but an appointee, an idiot from Niger Republic, Abu Bakar Malami, an appointee, truncated laws that senators voted, that is, a later senators made. And the senators kept quiet. Amalami truncated. DSS, that senate made laws. And um, allowed and recruited DSS. The senator made the laws. But DSS disobeyed court orders. They disobeyed the laws that senator that approved their existence made. Now somebody comes to me and says, is a senator, is a honorable distinguished? You must be a fool, a very mad person. Now, do you know that as far as Malami disobeyed court order, that all the senators have become nullified? Do you know the reason? Nigeria no longer have constitution. The constitution that made them senators is the constitution that instituted appeal court. 
That very constitution instituted um, federal high court. So how can you be senator? You made laws. And an appointee, not elected, Malami truncated it. And you were quietly sleeping very, very well. And you come to me, you say you are a senator. His Excellency is a senator. This thing is senator. This thing. Senator is just a name in Nigeria. Because they don't act. Now, this time around, now imagine a senator and House of Rep members that Nam De Kano exposed the death of their president to the world. When the Namdekano was brought back to Nigeria. Do you know that these senators and House of Red members of Nigeria was not able to confront the Attorney General of Nigeria, Abubakar Malami, to add in the charges against the Namdekano, the very insult on the President of Nigeria, alleging that the Namdekano, um, that Buhari is dead. Was it not the duty of the senators? And the House of Red members to defend the image of their country by confronting their president and say, Before you leave office, please kindly clear the image of this country from the very allegation by a man that is already in your custody. You have access for him to prove to you how you died and for you to prove to the world that you are worried. Very simple matter. But Nigeria is still accommodating that image. They refuse to persuade the very person they say is buried to hand it over. Before they hand over, please let Namdekanu, let bring Namdekanu to the House of Assembly or the Senate House. Let him prove to the world how Buari died. If you cannot tell Malami to add it in the charges during the trial, they even forgot that Namdekanu said that the Buhari molested Aisha at the age of nine. Why is it that the senator did not remind Malami to add it? Why is it that Nigerian youth did not protest and tell Malami to defend to defend the image of Nigeria by adding in the charges? That Namikano said that Buhari raped Aisha at the age of 11, 13 years and they molested Aisha at the age of nine. That Namikano said, wherever that, that Muslims in Nigeria that if his own, even if five years Fulani, he will lead in prayer. Even Tinubu, Tinubu cannot lead in prayer. Where five years Fulani is, he cannot lead in prayer, Muslim prayer, he cannot. Why is it that they didn't add it in the churches? Why is it that the senators and House of Red members are comfortable with the image that a dead president was ruling them? Why are they comfortable? Why is Nigeria comfortable? Why are they afraid in clearing this image? Why have they tried to accommodate it? Why are they going to court to challenge their election when they have truncated their image? When they have destroyed their image? When they allowed a dead president to conduct election for them? What do they expect in the court? Nigeria. Nigeria Excuse me. Excuse me, please. I'm coming. Okay. I'm back. Do you understand? We are asking them, why are they comfortable with the crimes against humanity? Because now they can't say it. Today, here we are. Finally, Tinubu used the opportunity to become president. He threatened the Kabas with the death of Buhari when they wanted to, 
to do him like this. That was an opportunity that IPOB created, Namikan created for the Nigerian youth. To raise such topic and Tinubu will run away, the Kabas will run away, they will leave your Nigeria for you. It is in your hand to tell the church or the organization that your father is dead or your mother is dead. If you if, if it is Catholic, if you didn't tell them, they will not give you date of burial. That's what the world was waiting. If Nigeria complained that what they are seeing is not their father, then the world will come up. That's what Anandikan was telling them. If you present good, the world will accept good. And some media will say, hey, why did you accept the in Commonwealth meeting? Because you presented him as your president. It's not the duty of the US to say, this is not your president. It is your duty. They, you help them to pamper the idiot. Today, they have rigged the election. In our opinion. Do you think your frustration can affect an American? You are the one that frustrated yourself. You saw the amended camp charges against an American then, when he was facing trial. You saw it was MSAS. You saw it was unknown government. You saw it was attack on, uh, what is it called? INEC facility. You saw it was all about attack on, what is it called? Checking point. That's what we saw. MSAS. That's what we saw. You did not ask the Nigerian government. Why is it that you didn't add the allegation that we already died? Why? Is it not the man that said it? Why are you not adding it? When Nigeria was silent on this matter, that's when they killed themselves. They brought the man who gave your president the allegation. You read out the charges. You saw it. It was published. First amended five can charges. Next one, seven amended can charges. The next was 15 amended can charges. In all this, there was nothing like insult on Buhari. They did not say he insulted Buhari. They did not say he gave the president the allegation that he's dead. Nobody said it. Why are they running away from such? And today you want to you accommodate the image and you want that image to be presented. So you want, if you say I'm a Nigerian and people start loving you with such image, you didn't challenge such image, you welcomed the image, you accommodated the image, you loved the image that a dead president ruled you for six years. Today you are suffering it. Mad people everywhere. I'm a child in here, you will know. Supreme Court judges, free them they can. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> we are dealing with the enemy. Now, the Supreme Court will be re resuming, re resuming, in fact, our, our court will be resume, will resume 25th. So, the 14th will not sit. We know that the, it was in dream, and our lawyers are doing their work. They have given you a signal. <laughs> They are just reminding us that we have debt of court. Not that it is shifted, no. How can Supreme Court judges fix date against, uh, before the date they will resume court? No, no, Supreme Court judges cannot do such mistake. Are they not judges anymore? Huh? Is Ari Wola not there? Ari Wola, are you not the ch chief judge of Nigeria? Are you not in Supreme Court? So are you aware of the adjournment in May? Adjournment of four months. And you are trying to tell us story. I, I know it was a dream. No, it, it, because the date of the court is divine. Coincident, 14th of September, Python Dance, 2017. And then the Canos appear at uh, Supreme Court ERN 2023, 14th of September 2023. So don't see it as a dream. See the court, right? It is not a dream. So it's not a mistake. Tell those that tell you to postpone the case, tell them no. The date of court is defined. It's not a mistake. But if you think you can truncate it, then you see the payback. We are not here for Joko. We are not begging to free Namika. We secure victory in court. It must be obeyed. 
are you because I am back. We are going to tell us in a court area. When you brought Fulani, they came with the casket. Malami sent them. They wrote it in American terrorist. They came with the big banner. They write the IPOB terrorist. Did you beg us? When you lock the court and our lawyers was not able to come in inside the court that very day, did you beg us? When you touch on Namdekan eight days in Kenya, did, did you beg us? Mad people. You brought Namdekan to Nigeria. You was not able to bring the warrant whereby you stole the word that he was he jumped there. And you even faced the same this second case in the same court of Bintanyako. Bintanyako. And the Prince Tanyako was there. What federal government brought was amended count charges. But this is the federal government of Nigeria that was telling the world that Nam the Ghana John Bear. Which bear did he jump? The warrant that Binta was holding. Isn't it? Is that not the warrant? Then that very warrant should have been in court. There should not be amended count charges. Instead, you bring a new warrant. You would have brought a new warrant if you think he's involved in NSAS, you think he's involved in unknown government, it will be a fresh warrant. Because you told the world he jumped there. What you are supposed to present in court was the warrant he was granted bail on, which the charges are there. Terrorism charges, um, mutiny, that is uh, treason, that Buhari committed in 1983, December 31st. He charged Namdekanu Tris. We say, okay, we know Buhari who committed it against Nigeria people. You push away Shagari, but you want Namdekanu to answer your case. You know, Nigeria refused to prosecute you, so you now see a man you prosecute with your crime. You committed against a legitimate president of Nigeria, Allah the Chief Shagari. Namdekanu answered the case of Buhari. And Nigeria was clapping. That Buhari committed treason. He was charging Namikan for treason. <laughs> That's when I saw that Nigeria is rubbish. They were clapping for a terrorist Buhari who committed treason. As he was charging an innocent man for treason, he committed 1983, December 31st. I'm a child. And I've been. I'm a child. 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 But in UK 14, 14 September, it truncated your day and your Now we ask them, Bin Tanyaku and Nigerian government, was it these very amended camp charges, though we have destroyed them, which we know that almost the date of all the charges started from 2018, that you, Mr. Namdekan, from 2018 to 2021, from, that you, Mr. Namdekan, from 2018 to 2021, that you, Mr. Namdekan, from 2018 to 2021, Go and read the charges, 15 American charges, that's what you'll be hearing. Then we ask them, this is a man, you invaded his house on the 14th of September 2017. Why is it that the new charges started from 2018? Then where is the warrant he jumped bail on? Where is the warrant he refused to come and stand the trial? Where is the warrant you say he must stand his trial? Where is that warrant? You ended up coming up with new charges because you know that that warrant is dead. Immediately the issue of that warrant is raised in court then the issue of the invasion of his house will be raised. That's what Bintanyako told the federal government. And the federal government said, okay, let us keep it aside. Let us come with amended can charges. I tell them that you are wrong and you will fail the case. You will lose it. You are supposed to come with that very warrant that Bintanyako signed bail. That warrant, the charges there are still fresh, as you think. But we know that Ademola decided those charges. John Soho decided those charges. Justice Ahmed Mohammed told DSS to go and obey the previous court rulings. That's the ruling of Adamola and the ruling of John Soho. At the end, Bin Tanyako granted the same case bail. But uh, let us just treat on the bail Bin Tanyako granted. Do they allow him to enjoy it? No. Now you get the point. Now you get the point. Why you mention Kelly? I know my brother can in touch. Can handle it, but we're not going. Actually, we're supposed to give the wall again. Change the narrative. Wall again. If they are in Wahale, 
They are your post now. Wall again. Channel lawyer afraid of the can. Channel lawyer on Supreme Court. Then, a move over the shake here now. Let us stop cross them. Two weeks, I need it. Two weeks, Rien dia hot. Aki nyere ha. Waka ha jano. E on Supreme. Ndi lawyer sabo kwe mbo eni. Ndi abago mbo ebe ha kwa karanda de fa. Kai dop cross ha na chay boso. Dop cross ha mehe ye ye ni huwa. La ande a ni ye. Thank you. Go on, no. Nigeria is gone, as simple as that. And my children, oh, I'm saying, my brother, I'm late. This can make IPOB family members. Be a France. In my name, be a France that replace the IPOB family members. They are falling away. Uh, those hardcore be a France that are not on that oath. How replace them? They stood with IPOB to this point. Now, here I'm going to now, now I'm with date of court. 14th of September. I want information from lead cast up here in here line. In my business, up line with a line. In here, I get where they don't like information. Kairu Swari, why not a poor sugar? In here, I had a poor sugar there for date of court. In here, I get my chief there who all over the world now will put the Supreme Court in condition to favor the lawyers. Okay, I can hear not now. Iranian they are hot. These two weeks, right? How much of the two are there? How can I two are cause? But they match your handkit. They match your handkit. In my name, I am a lawyer. Sign your. They match your Supreme Court handkit. My name is not a lawyer. Sign your. I am not a lawyer. I am not a lawyer. I am not a reflect in a court. Okay, man, I'm going to reflect on court. Now reflect on DSS. <laughs> it's an a lawyer say she kike. I don't have argument. I don't have argument with IPOB. My IPOB is in a fight. Lawyer can you defend the activities of IPOB. And I am going to ask. Have you ever seen a school that scheduled to that closed their school in July to resume school in September, on the September 25th, and the ninth fees exam on the 14th of September. Have you ever seen it? <laughs> and that's what they want to present to us from the highest court, Supreme Court. Now, I'm going to diary. I give you no diary this time. I will provide diary for you. You see, Supreme Court will give all of you diary. You don't have diary. Uh, uh, where are you in Germany and pick the third of court? So you traveled out and pick your adjournment on a special matter. Disobedient to court order. Illegal detention. And the health condition of an American. And they went to the we have endurance for four months. Somebody went on a big one. Do you know what is four months? We that you are supposed to be petting, you are making us angry. We have secured victory. We are supposed to be honored. And then Namdekano must be honored. Which is called a peak of victory. Honor. Not pardon. Some people will tell us, let us look for our political solution. Are you mad? It's only a convict that you can give pardon. Or somebody that is still facing trial. That's somebody you will give pardon. Namdekano is not a convict of terms of like a convict of terms of jail. He's not a convict in CC, condemned criminal. Not a convict of um, life, life imprisonment. Not awaiting trial. That's where there will be pardon. That's where there will be political solution. That's where there will be first of all, where political solution will come in the case of Namdekano is on the issue of Biafra. You know, some of these people that are bringing on their national daily, national television, the way they used to run away, let me tell you, some said, 
The other one was saying, in everything that happened, even if you are fighting, there will be negotiation. That one is different. Negotiation is on the issue of Biafra. That's when you allow Namdekanu to go first. When he go, allowing him to go is not on that political solution or negotiation. You are respecting your court. You are respecting your constitution. You are honoring your country. The constitution is your country. Then it's when he reach home. You will now say, okay, uh -huh, that Biafra you are talking. How are we going to do it? You can't persuade him why in another detention for an table. It doesn't happen. It, it doesn't happen. His senses must be in order. He will cool down his brain. He will treat himself. He will be in order. He will be reasoning. He will have rest of mind and discuss with you. He can't be on pressure. He must be freed before on roundtable. Because you did not present roundtable when you brought him. You presented the court. He defeated you in court. So you must obey the court order. Then negotiation will come. Our door is always open for negotiation. But you don't negotiate your court order. You don't discuss court order. Court order is greater than the order of the president. President can give order and send army, and court will stop president from sending army. Court will stop president from traveling. President order is ordinary to court order. But those that they are interviewing, they are the lecturer, they are intellectual, they, they are not sensible because. But they don't reason fine. How can you tell me that they need to negotiate? Negotiate what? Negotiate court ruling or negotiate behalf? We can negotiate by referendum. That's the negotiation. It has been there since the door is always open. We need be a fair referendum. It is there. But court ruling is a lie. You don't negotiate court ruling. Are you mad? You negotiate court ruling. You have to go for constitutional amendment. Not to court ruling. You can amend and abolish a B court. But you must obey the ruling of a B court before you abolish it. You can abolish your federal high court. That's your business. You can stay without court. That's it. But do you see the rulings of the court before you do so? You must obey it before. So we are dear friends. We don't stop you from abolishing your court. All right? But you must obey court order. Are you now getting the point? <laughs> it Thank you. Thank you. Excuse me. Let me see some water. So, let me drop a few words and the random. They must sit our court. 14th of September. Two, 14th of September is a coincidence. 14th of September, 2017. Python dance. 14th of September, 2023. Supreme Court date of hearing. Okay, large court there. And the final hearing. Now you get the two points, two arguments. Now, what is it called? Malam senators. All the Nigerian senators are useless for allowing an appointee to truncate court order. The constitution that senators made. Malami was sitting, an appointee, he truncated it. That makes the senators useless. So, if you hear senators begging in the red chamber about Namdekan, that's when you see the end of Senate. What you are supposed to hear from Nigerian Senate is to sanction the Minister of Justice. They have fair law. Then, also, bring their anger on DSS. 
Because what DSS is fighting is their effort in the Senate and the effort of the House of Red members in making laws. Now, the law will come to the court. The judges will now interpret the law and pass judgment. And that is the honor of the Senate. And that is the honor of the country. But they are there and they saw an appointee, not elected, Malami appointee, not a, a minister is an appointee. Appointee. Can you compare a minister with a senator? Senator is elected, representing constitutions or senatorial zone. Representing the people. Who voted in uh, the minister? Those ministers are not the, the people, are there, most of them failed election. They are not even honorable. People like them were mine. Why do I respect him? He failed, he contested, he, he contested the election and failed. So, what is the excellency there now? He's now a minister. So, he will be fighting us with anger. He will be ang he's angry, he did not win Senate. So, how can a minister who contested for a Senate will now come and truncate laws that senators made? Just like Malami. Did he win minister? No, you can't win a minister. You can be appointed a minister. But somebody won Senate. And an appointee truncated it. That's my anger on the senators. Oh, that's how we reason. This is how we reason. If you don't, reason, if you don't want to reason, fine. That's your business. For IPOP, we reason very fine. That's why argument are not this strong. And you want to go to the reason of me. And I didn't want to go to the reason of me. And I didn't want to go to the they have lies. So they, that's why they always fail. They trust in their words. The type UB does not rush. We follow, we start from scratch. Because we don't have words. We don't have crude oil to lobby people. We don't have lies. The lies is Nigerian media. So if we are in charge of lies, any Nigerian media house is lie. They are about to, rename is lie. If you write Vanguard, put it lie. You write a punch, lie at the end. You write nations, lie. All of them are liars. Do you understand? We thank you for listening. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for viewing. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for liking. Thank you for your time. Thank you for spending your data. Thank you for praying for Nandekan. Thank you for standing with IPOB. Thank you for fighting Nigeria in their crimes. Thank you because we have stood firm and strongly with our leader Namdekan for two years plus. Thank you for not disappointing him. Thank you and in that, on that point, we thank our Creator in heavens for sustaining us upon the heat, upon everything we saw to this very point, and it will still sustain us, we will cross the next level and get our freedom. Thank you. Thank you. From me, fearless IPB evangelist Master Madam Chemachuku, and from here, Homeland Radio Biafra, here in Biafra land. It is. Good evening.